Peter, the topic of today's quiz is names for groups of animals. Okay. Okay, you got it? Yes. This is a fun one. You're going to like this. We're going to start out easy, okay? Thank you. What do you call a group of fish? Okay, a school of fish. Correct. Okay, yeah. A group of dogs. A pack of dogs. Yes. A group of puppies, puppy dogs. A litter. Yes, good. A group of wolves is called a? A pack. Yep. Lions, a group a, of a lions. Pride. Yeah. All right. These are getting harder. You're right. <laughs> a group of monkeys is called? A tribe? No. A, no. Uh, tell me. Having fun with a... Really? A barrel of monkeys? Yeah. They really call They oh. call them a barrel. Gee. Isn't that funny? Yeah. Okay, now they get a little harder. So you're going to get multiple choice on these. Thank you. A group of giraffe yeah. is called a tower, a pod, or a stand. Oh, I do think it's a tower. That's correct. A group of... Isn't that funny? Mm-hmm. Tower. A group of tigers is called a litter, a troop... Or an ambush. Oh, geez. I'll go with troop. Ambush. Wow. Ambush of tigers. So concrete. I know. A group of owls. Hooters. Yeah, baby. Loomer, loomers <laughs> or parliament. Uh, yeah, parliament. Yeah, you know that one. I know that one. That was funny. Frogs. A group of frogs is called a hopper, an army, or a ribbit. How about an army? Yes. That's interesting. You can call a group of elephants a herd, but you can also call a group of elephants what? A heavy load, a parade, or a gang? I'll go parade. Parade is correct. Here's a good one. A group of hyenas is called what? And I'm going to give you a hint, unless you think you know it. I need the hint. Your hint is chickens... And maybe some would say our vice president makes this kind of noise when she laughs. A cackle. Yes. A group of hyenas is called a cackle. Wow. I never heard that one. A group of dolphins is called a mob, a pod, or a cod. A pod. Pod is correct. That I know. A group of oysters is called a pile, a cluster, or a bed. Uh, I know the term oyster bed. I'll go with bed. Bed is correct. You're doing pretty good, Peter. Javelinas live and travel in groups called what? A squadron, a gang, or storm? I'll go storm. Squadron. Squadron. A group of crows, you and I have talked about this one, so you should get it right, is called? A group of crows is called a... Don't remember. Murder. Oh, yeah. A group of snakes is called a nest, a stick, or sliver. A nest. Nest is correct. A group of geese is called a giggle, a gaggle, or a waddle. A gaggle of geese. That's correct. Yes. Porcupines. Mm. A group of porcupines is called the prickle. A spiny or a spiky? I'll go prickle. Prickle is correct. Yeah. Prickle of porcupines. Now, instead of asking you to name the names for groups of animals, I'm going to give you the name. Okay. And you're going to tell me what group of animals it refers to, okay? A mob refers to a group of what? And here's your hint. Australians refer to them as ruse. Oh, mob of kangaroos. Yes. An unkindness, remember that one, refers to a group of what? We've talked about this. I don't remember. Ravens, chickens, or hogs? An Uh, unkindness. Hogs. Ravens. I don't remember that at all. So a group of crows is called a murder, and ravens and crows are related, but they're not the same. Ravens are larger, their beaks are different, and they have different flight patterns from the crows. So a group of ravens is called an unkindness. A group of crows is called a murder. A stand refers to a group of pelicans, ostriches, flamingos. Yeah, I'll go flamingos. 
Flamingos is correct. Yeah. A crash is a group of rhinos, rabbits, alligators. Rhinos. Yes. Wow. They're so colorful. Aren't they? Yeah. I know. A thunder is a group of zebras, mice, or hippos. Oh, gee. How about zebras? Hippos. <laughs> that makes sense. Yeah. The thunder of hippos. You can, like, hear them. I guess. Okay. I guess. I... A sleuth or sloth is the name for a group of sloths, bears, snails. Oh. Trick question, huh? A sleuth of snails. I'll go with a sleuth of snails. No, a sleuth of bears. A sleuth of bears. Wow. A convocation yeah. can be used to describe a group of penguins, eagles, or ants. I think eagles. Eagles is correct. I think we've talked about that. This group of animals is often noisy, chaotic, and manic. Hence, they might be called a pandemonium. And here's another hint. They can live over 100 years. Let's see. Noisy, chaotic, manic. What animals live over 100 years? Tortoises. What other animal lives over 100 years? Uh, different, a bird? A gray parrot? Parrots, good. Really? A group of parrots is a pandemonium. Wow. An intrusion refers to this group of animals. And your hint is Florida probably has the worst infestation of these bugs and probably the largest of these guys as well. What's an intrusion? You said bugs? Uh Uh-huh. They are cockroaches. Yes. Okay, your last one. You can call this group of animals whom we share 98.3% of their DNA with, either a band or a troop. Your hint is adult males are known as silverbacks. Oh, those are gorillas. Yes. Wow. Good, Peter. Good. I think pretty bad. Okay. But it is it is fascinating, some of these names. Isn't it? Really interesting. It's like, who made up these names? Yes. <laughs> 